Hello and welcome to TM Key Film. In this YouTube, I was in the Straits of Juan de Fuca when I was chartering out of CQ and came across an abandoned net that my downrigger and camera system got hung up into. We started to ring our gear up. We had a film boat with us because we were doing a whole segment on how to fish CQ. And so with our film boat taking care of the far away shots, we were able to put the camera down and really study what's happening in the waters of our northwest with these abandoned derelict gear. These nets, they float in pieces actually. And there's a shot of our boat that's shooting us. And here's a shot underwater of that net and the way that these fish are just rotting away. And we're in a depth right now of only 120 foot of bottom depth, but this is the surface. And now you get a better shot of how many fish are in this from our film boat. And we're just right now floating along and taking a look at this net. It's amazing all the different fish in there, including our endangered salmon. What a waste, huh? And if I look real close, I believe it's a wild fish on top of that. You can see the adipulse fin. Even though it's fairly decomposed, it's been in there a while. And, it, and if you look at the... What is that? The kelp? If you look at that, and there's another one, salmon, I'm not quite sure if it's a chum or, or what that was, a lot of bottom fish, black sea bass right there I know for sure, I've caught a lot of those. So this net's been out drifting around for some time. Let's go back into time and check out what I did to start Ghost Nets of Washington State. Check this out. Hello everyone, I'm Dale Kempke, and for much of my life I've spent fishing and making my living from the waters of Puget Sound. Today, I'm launching my little boat in an estuary there's not a lot of water here. See, these nets get hung up on the bottom. We wait for the low water. We get in there with our boat and we're able to remove them. And that's what this program's all about. Ghost Nets and Derelict Gear of Washington State is put together of sponsors like you that want to be a part of something positive. You see, what I'm talking about is derelict gear. What is derelict gear? How do you find it? Generally, it's anything that's left over from either sport fishing or commercial netting and crabbing, shrimping, you got the idea. King 5 TV documented recently just gave us one example of my team out in the habitat removing this derelict gear. Will you help to support us to ensure future projects? Good people really can make good things happen. I'm looking forward to hearing from you soon, and together we can make a difference. <laughs> 